Hi family! Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Rosalind. Now you guys, today we're in the book of Matthew, Matthew 6 verse 33. This verse always speak to me and I'm hoping that it will speak to somebody today. This is what the verse said, Matthew 6 verse 33 to 34. It says, But seek first his kingdom and his righteousness, and all these things will be given to you as well. Therefore, do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about itself. Each day has enough trouble of its own. This is what your heavenly father is speaking to you. He's saying, put him first in all you do. Seek him first in all your ways. Acknowledge him, and then he will make your path straight. You see, sometimes we turn to focus on all the problems and all the situation that we're going through and forget to pull God first and forget to trust that God got us. You know what I'm saying? Like he's reinsuring us believers to this verse that we need not to worry that he got us. We are his children. And before we were formed in our mother's womb, he knew us. We have good things in store for us. He's also encouraging us in this verse to have faith and not to worry, to trust. But we can only trust God and rely on him when we're spending time with him and we're spending time in his word and we're spending time in prayer. The Bible said, draw near to me and I will draw near to you. The more we draw near to our heavenly father, the more we will put him first in all that we do. But if we're a distance away from him, then we'll be focusing on other stuff. I want us to truly ask ourselves this question. Are we seeking God first in all that we do? Are we putting him first in our decision, in our time? Are we putting him first? And if the answer is no, then I want us to apply this to our life by being intentional in reading his words and spending time with him in prayer and just allowing the Holy Spirit to just guide you to his words as you read his word. It's, you know, acknowledging him in your quiet time. Because the first thing we try to do in the morning sometimes is pick up our phone and just go about our day. But God want us to be intentional and put him first and he will lead our path. With that, I'd just like to say a quick prayer. Father, we just, we just trust you. We say have your way in our life. We surrender to you. We surrender our mind, will, and emotion to you. We say you lead God and we will follow. Give us the desire to stay in your presence, God. Give us the desire to read your word. Give us the desire to spend time in worship and in prayer. Holy Spirit, we call on you to move in our lives. So, Lord, that we can be a vessel for your kingdom. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. God bless you. God love you. Do me a favor. Like this video. If you have not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It's free. It don't cost a thing. And join the family. And also, you know, if you have a prayer request, drop a prayer request in the comment down in the comment section below and other people and me would join you in prayer. I love you all the love of God. Till next time, family. Bye.